Hello, this is the clock guy. I want to show you my new favorite clock. Yes, I have many favorite clocks, but they all seem to have one thing in common. They are all mid-century modern. And this is a classic mid-century modern clock from Schatz. It's a German clock manufacturer. You might know the name from the anniversary clocks, the ones with the glass domes and the spinning balls that you wind once a year. The lines, it in a way, doesn't it look like a uh, like a '57 Chevy, like a Bel Air with the uh, the chrome on the back? Very popular style, doesn't it, frugal mom? Oh, yes. Look, doesn't it look like a, the back of a 57 Chevy? Exactly what I was thinking. Made in Germany. There's the Schatz logo. This clock was made in 1970. High gloss in the front. And a dull rub on the top. clock is in perfect condition also. That's what I like so much about this. this one. There's the label on the bottom. I like the small legs on it very mid-century we have chairs with those same legs it's a little bit bigger there are club chairs from the 1950s we'll turn it around nice flat finish on the back This is where shots really shines. Inside the movement is machined. And it is a triple chime. So there's a lot of rods because you're playing three different tunes on it. Westminster, Whittington, St. Michael, and then you can Silence the chime if you'd like. It has a platform escapement, which is nice for several reasons. It's extremely accurate. There's virtually no maintenance. And you can turn the clock sideways and it will still run and keep good time. Try that with a pendulum. How about turning the clock on its end and it still runs and keeps accurate time. Why, that's a miracle. It is, isn't it? It has seven jewels to reduce friction. The jewels will go in these certain pivot holes. And there is virtually no wear with the jewels. Try one Whittington. And 
in St. Michael. This is the clock I sang. Thanks for watching.